We are about to see something good. The following is a six-man tornado tag team match. Introducing first from India, weighing in at 348 pounds, the great you know, I know for a fact that uh, there are a number of people in the locker room who dread getting in the ring with this superstar. Well, Byron, every superstar in that locker room is being paid to compete. So spare me the sob story. He said he'll be making a statement in this match tonight and will deliver it emphatically. success both in the ring and in Hollywood which is insane because for some reason the WWE Universe has never appreciated Batista quite enough well no question about it Batista will demand the respect of the WWE Universe right here tonight is here. Time for a beatdown cowboy style. And from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds. The Beast Incarnate has been involved in some of WWE's biggest matches. He's always a spectacle to see in action. And there are undoubtedly more unforgettable moments on their way. It's time to do it the Cowboy way.
Brock Lesnar's won multiple WWE and Universal title reigns. King of the Ring, the Royal Rumble, and Money in the Bank. And perhaps the most dominant competitor in WWE history. Lesnar's crushed countless champions and legends throughout his storied WWE career. I got a real strong feeling we're going to see more of that dominance courtesy of the Beast Incarnate. Guess what, folks? It's time to acknowledge the Tribal Chief. And representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. Well, here's a man who's held the Universal Championship for over two years. Greatness redefined. That's God mode. Part of the pantheon of all-time greats in the WWE. You can count on one hand the amount of people who've held the championship as long as Roman Reigns. even more powerful than ever. Make way for the double champ. And from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, the Rock! Only a small handful of WWE superstars have held two championships simultaneously, and this man now joins their ranks. Yeah, it's an honor no matter how long you hold both titles, but the reality is most double champions lose at least one title before long. This man is determined to be the exception rather than the rule. You talk about standing at the top of the mountain, this guy is at the peak of Mount Everest. Indeed, it is going to take a monumental effort to take either one of this guy's titles. in absolute awe. What a moment. And from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds, The Undertaker! The WWE Universe standing in reverence. No one embodies human suffering and inescapable peril more. Yeah, this isn't make-believe. It's like having real horror among us. A being who wields unspeakable power and transcends space and time. A dark fog envelops our arena and the creatures of the night are upon us. Entering the hollowed ground of WWE's Hall of Fame just made the Phenom stronger.
WWE Universe as the gates of hell have just opened. Expect punishing power. Devastating strikes. All courtesy of the dead man. Hall of Fame worthy dominance. And I truly believe in a matter of moments we will see yet another victim rest in peace. And this is a lot of superstars to keep track of all at once, but the good news is they're at least split up into teams. Yeah, tell that to the freaking ref, Cole. I don't think they're seeing things in terms of good news right about now. Who has to suck? And that was an efficient form of offense for that move. There is 
Charlotte needs to find the forearm that has made him a dominant force. Oh, a right hand for good measure. Gets slammed down. Tossed forward into the ring post. Dishing out a suplex. Some hellacious offense. Yeah, but we've seen The Undertaker rise from the grave so many times before. Will he pull it off again? Can't quite get him there. That was an effective attack, guys. The Rock with some good timing here. Oh, that one busted open the animal. Look at this. Just unloading. Here's the pump handle. Suplex. Carefully placed stop to the arm. Don't come over here. Cole, quick. Use Saxton as a human shield. Sit up, Powerbomb. Lesnar cuts him off. Held in a perilous position. Taken down with a body slam. Drop. Very nice. Ooh, again. Sit straight into the barricade. Targeting a fine part. Worked in the arm. Oh, go back up. They're, they're getting too close for comfort. Well, no one's paying attention to you, Saxon. They're too busy beating the tar out of each other. And he gets set back into the ring. Solid punch. A worrying and a challenge from the Reaper to his opponent. Oh, he has the answer for the rock. And now gets tossed into the ring.
Cross right for him. The return Cross. Look at him. Pride and poise personified. And he tosses it back in now. Delivered into the barricade. Got him set up. This could be a call. That's who stepped on. Batista got all of them. What's the Undertaker got in mind here? Hey, man. How about we take things a little old school? Yeah, I like it.
stop your opponent. Cut off with a kick to the gut. And that one misses the mark. Kick to the gut. Cracked around into a neck breaker. won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. Bear hug! Well placed down the middle. We'll get you out of it. That might be enough. Yes, it is. And talk about giving a DDT with authority. Battling ringside, and our announce table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. Well, I get nervous when the fight comes out here, guys. Into the barricade. Superstars put on quite a show. Here's another look. Here are your winners. Roman Reigns, The Rock, and The Undertaker. Nice teamwork by these three to pick up the win. Show up, get the W, and get out. Not a bad night's work, I'd say.